you have been using Eagle for a while now. And we would like to take this opportunity to say thank you. And also provide you a brief explanation how to use the new CAM processor or the enhanced CAM processor with the earlier available CAM jobs and how to convert them to the new system. Hi, this is Edwin Robledo from Autodesk Eagle with today's tip. You're going to be using the exam cam icon that you're used to. And this will load the new cam job. To load your cam job, what you're going to do is you're going to click on load job, local jobs, and here you'll see the jobs that are actually come with Eagle by default, which are located in the Eagle cam folder. I'm just going to go ahead and select the Gerber 274X for layers. As you could see on my output file section, each under the legacy title, each section is now viewed from here. On the right pane, you could see exactly what's going to do. This is an interface similar to the one that you're already used to. If I click on process job, all the Gerber files will be created as you're used to. The files will be in the exact same folder as your board file. They'll have the same name as your board and they'll have the appropriate extension just like what you're used to. Now, if you wish to convert sections of your CAM job to the new template system, the only thing you need to do is actually double click the section. You'll be prompted by a dialog box letting you know that it will be converted to the new system and you can click OK. On my next video, we're going to be going into detail with the new CAM processor and how does it work. Just wanted to let you know that the CAM processors that you have been working with or if you've downloaded from other resources are 100% compatible. Thank you for joining me. Have a great day.